The Median is a story-driven, atmosphere-building game from Bloober Team with some new fresh ideas in the genre creating a new experience. However, there are some things I wish I knew before starting The Medium that overall would have made it a better experience. Also, there is no spoilers here, so don't worry as we begin the video. Right off the bat, you'll want to turn off your achievement notifications. The medium gives achievements pretty frequently and sometimes during key moments. It just draws you out of the experience. You would have thought Blooper Team did some testing with the game and that they would have came to the conclusion of, well, maybe that's not the right time for this to pop, but however, that was totally missed. So as you play this, the notifications can get a little irritating, especially during some key moments. So make sure to turn that off before you start the game. I sadly have been unable to get a Series X due to shortages and my PC is starting to show its age. Being an i7 and a GTX 970 SLI combination, it handles majority of the games such as Gears War 5 with ease at 60 frames per second, you know, at 440, but the medium on the other hand, once the game splits the view of the both worlds and does the multi-world rendering, it sadly drops to 720 at probably 30 frames. I was stunned when I saw this. Also kind of saddened because the image quality was so poor and I was really looking forward to playing this, you know, in high fidelity. After some testing, I made sure to close every app except the game and definitely not try to stream it and definitely not try to record. And I was able to get back to 1080, but keep in mind, play with the settings, lower the FPS to 30 to give you a little bit more bandwidth. It's not a very action heavy game, so you'll probably get past the fact that you're playing in 30 after a little bit. So that's one recommendation. The median introduces new mechanics and skills as the game progresses. Sometimes they show you them and you won't use them for a while, leading you to forget or that you even had it. I spent a good amount of time stuck because I totally forgot I had this sensibility, just mainly because I used it early on, then I just totally forgot about it because I didn't find a use for it. So keep a mental note of these abilities and exercise them frequently just to make sure you don't end up in the same spot I ended. Read everything. There isn't a whole lot to read and collect, but I highly recommend it. Every time you read an item, Marine gives a nice little context or comment, really highlighting the world. Then you start to wonder what really happened here at the hotel and the backstories of the people for the, the belongings you find. The subtle way Blooper Team brings the medium's world alive is applause worthy, and I highly recommend you don't skip out on this aspect. Now, Median isn't a very heavy action focused game, I would say, or even combat focused game, since you can't really fight back at all, but make sure you have your left hand charged at all times. There was multiple times where bad timing and overuse led me to backtrack to get a charge or just dying because I just didn't have a shield or anything to like protect me. So I always recommend to, you know, make sure you're fully stocked and loaded before you head out into the wilderness. Hopefully this list helps you enjoy the medium to its fullest. With these minor tweaks or knowledge, it really brought me to the best experience for the later half of the game. And it's just stuff I wish I knew sooner. So I hope you guys enjoyed the game. Leave a comment down below if you guys like the game. If you guys don't care about the game, you guys think it sucked, whatever it is, just leave a comment down below. Leave a like because it does help out the algorithm. And other than that, guys, until next time, have a good night. Bye.